Hello, Jefferson Multimedia. How are you doing? We are at the end of the semester. We're almost at spring break. Spring break is like next week, isn't it? So I'm grading stuff like crazy right now in my classes. I am grading Freaky Fruit 1, Freaky Fruit 2, and then Head Swap 1 and Head Swap 2. So we have four different grades for Photoshop. This is a class of 23. How many people have actually turned stuff in? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So 13 out of 23 have turned stuff in. 10 out of 23, I have nothing from them so far. Remember, when you submit things to me from Photoshop, you need to quick export as PNG and then email it to me. Within that email message, click on the paperclip, attach it, and send it. Do not share it in Creative Cloud. I won't look at it. Do not share it in Schoology. I won't look at it. Do not send it to me in any other format than PNG. In many cases, I can't open it. I received 64 different emails where they sent me the graphics in the wrong format. That's 64 different emails where we messed it up. Come on, Patriots. I know we can do better than that. Before you start downloading the video so you can work in Adobe Premiere Rush, you need to open up your grades. Do you have a grade for Fruit 1? Fruit 2? Do you have a grade for Swap 1? Swap 2. You should only be downloading videos if you have grades for all four of these. Now, if you're saying to yourself, I know I turned that in, I need you to prove that to me because otherwise 15 students will come to me each day and say, tell me if I've turned in my work or not. I don't have time to do that for that many people. So let me show you how you can know if you've turned in your work or not. Most of us are in our inbox. In my case, it's underneath folders. Yours may be different from mine, whatever. But the way I want you to check and see if you've turned in those graphics in PNG format, I want you to click on sent items. Once you've done that, I want you to find the message that you sent to me and click on it. When that happens, look and see. Did I send it to him in PNG or did I send it to him in another format? If you sent it to me in another format, you do not have a grade. If you sent it to me in the proper format, I will add all those grades to Power Teacher, but I will not add the grades until you send it in the proper format like you were taught and we literally quizzed over six times. Oh, P.S. When you say, hey, there's a couple of grades you haven't entered here yet, that means yes. I'm grading so much, I don't have all the grades in the gradebook right now. I will grade as quickly as I can, but keep in mind, I'm trying to grade all hour, every hour, while we do the work. And a lot of people are asking me to reteach them the things that I've already taught. And remember with Schoology, all the stuff that I've taught is already there. If you're struggling on how to use Adobe Premiere Rush, maybe check out this post. What could be at the bottom? How to edit. With Premiere Rush, click on it. The tutorial is there. All the stuff that you've seen in class is right here. But you have to look for it. You have to click on it. And yeah, if you've forgotten every single detail, you may need to rewatch one, two, three, four videos to remind yourself how to do the head swap. Those of you that say you don't know how to email me something, why don't you start with this post right here? And it's really simple because all you have to do is click on my email address and your email will open up. I make it really, really simple, but a lot of people think if I get an A on the quiz, I've got an A in the course. That's not the truth. Keep in mind, quizzes are only 20% of your grade. You have to remember the things I've taught and you need to do them. If you don't remember how to do them, you need to watch the videos again instead of asking me to reteach everything. And everything you need is laid out for you right here, going all the way back, Photoshop, then Freaky Fruit before that. Then I clarify sometimes, watch the assignment to make sure we know. And we quiz over what the assignment is. Then scripts before that for the movie scene remake. How to film and edit on your phone, which I think seven out of a hundred and something students did. So everything we've done from the very beginning of the semester is right here. So yes, you need to know what you've sent 
to me or not by checking what your sent mail file and then opening it and making sure that that graphic you sent me was a PNG if it was something else I didn't put it in the gradebook so I'll need it in PNG format and remembering if we have a couple of grades I haven't put in the gradebook yet if it's a blank it doesn't help it doesn't hurt it's just something I haven't put in the gradebook yet so keep in mind I'm doing lots and lots of things while only 14 out of 23 students in this class have turned in anything. And usually, I'm the one that the students tell, you're not working hard enough. Nope. Don't think so. Step up. We need to do the stuff the way we're taught. I want you to be responsible. I want you to know if you've done the work or not. And if you're relying on me to tell you if you have done your work or not, I'm doing most of the thinking. We need to flip that. Because guess who needs to do most of the thinking in this class? That's right. It's you. That's all I got. Thanks. Bye-bye.